Well, hello and welcome back. Uh, last time I spent basically. I've uh, got hiccups now. I spent basically the entire video searching for a hunt that didn't actually uh, exist, apparently. At least I couldn't find the labyrinth. And I'm not gonna waste this video trying to make up for those mistakes. I think what we'll do for now, I think I mentioned this at the end of the last video, I think a lot of things when I take a couple days off between recordings, but we're going to go ahead and just go on with the story for now. We don't ever get completely locked out of these places, if I remember. Except for Mon, brief periods is it really of time. You? I heard you got took off to Nalbina. The Imperials will need more than a dungeon to stop me. You broke out of a dungeon? Whoa! Hey, try and keep it down, would you? Pinello isn't around, is she? Out on a delivery, maybe? Dead in a nope, dungeon? No, haven't seen her all day. Not like her to up and skip out on work like that. Miguelo's not here either. He went running off somewhere a little while ago. So much for my big welcome. I guess everybody's busy. Yeah, it's all about you, man. I got my hands full watching the shop, and old Dallin had something for me to do, but I can't get away. Old Dallin, huh? Hmm. Tell you what, I'll go see him for you. Really? Well, nothing better to do. Except maybe that hunt that's also down there? Hello, shop clerk. He noticed the stone that I had. That's, that's not good. Um, let's see. I can equip a dagger, but nothing else. Wow, a cherry staff is plus six attack power. If any of this is an upgrade, nope. Close. Reduces experience earned to zero. What the hell is the point of that? Does anyone have an explanation for that? Why would you not want to level up? When attacked, automatically counter with weapon in hand. That's probably something that will be very good on ban. Half damage to maybe that's water. Tourmaline ring. Poison and sap. Some of these items probably wouldn't be good to have just in case you get yourself into a bind. Um, I'm not even gonna bother selling anything right now. I'm just gonna stockpile a whole bunch of junk. If I do have the money, I will um, end up just spending it all. Excuse me, coming through. Just have to remember where the stairs are. Right behind me. Okay. Camera, let me go. Let my camera go. I could take the shortcut to Old Delon, run to the gate, or teleport to it. But I think I might try this hunt. I mean, since we're down here and all, my only problem is going to be finding it. Um, I think. Who's that person behind me? Zoom. I'm going to use this all the fucking time. Okay, this is the place. Milha! You've come about the bill? Wonderful. I had started to think I'd posted it in vain. It's only been 30 minutes. But I'll not mince words. A child has shut himself inside this house because he's frightened of a ghost he says he saw in the neighborhood. He said he'll come out if I got rid of this ghost. So I went looking for it, you know, to humor him. Imagine my surprise when I found it was real. There was no way I could deal with it on my own, so I had to call you in. Will you accept this hunt? Sure I will. Hmm. I have to go all the way back to the Garamsythe waterway. An apparition called a Wrath. And I think it came to avenge the cruel slaying of rats and other poor denizens of the waterway. But, uh, yeah. I'm not pointing any fingers or anything. If it's here, it's got to be dealt with, so I'll leave it to you. 
pretty sure I can be doing both hunts at the same time. I have absolutely no idea how many hunts I can ultimately accept. But due to my nature of not always completing things, I have a feeling that we're going to find that out at some point. Come here, Delon. I had my cigar in my hand. Will you fucking click the door? I have to line up with the actual handle. It's very precise. Hello, Delon. Are you surprised to see me alive and well? Well, well. Look who we have here. Heard you were sent off to Nalpina. You heard wrong. And I got out of there as fast as I could. But it was all worth it, Dallin. Here, look at this. You fool my, my, of a my. kid. Quite a treasure you've got there. Well, you know, I couldn't have done it without your help. So, there is more to this gutter churl than first meets the eye. Van Ivanaren, a simple favor to beg of you. Oh, really? I was going to ask that kites to go, but I should think that you ought to do. No. No, I think you're just the one. There's a fellow by the name of Azalas, and I need you to bring this sword to him. That's... that's a sword of the old order. Speak my name when you arrive. That should be enough to get you in to see him. I've made a note on your map showing you where he can be found. Mind you, you are to deliver the sword to him personally. Oh, I will. Hey, Dal, do you think I could get you to do something for me? I need you to find out where Pinello is. I wanted to show her what I got from the palace, but I haven't been able to find her anywhere. It's because she's dead, Vaughn. Can you let me know if you hear anything? You can just leave that to me. She was blown up. Thanks, Dallin. By one of those orbital strikes on the palace. And so it is done. But will it be enough to remind him of what the Order once meant? The Jedi Order. You must take him this lightsaber. Take it to Obi-Wan. You must stir his memories. But not too much. Not too much. You cannot have too strong of his emotion. Yes, I get it. I obtain a sword. So, you were kind enough to mark it on my map, huh? How far do I... Uh, that's not actually that far. For some reason, I was expecting it to you know, be all the way on the outskirts of the desert somewhere. I'm just going to go at a regular pace right now. Does it cut through here? Cut through here and then go up. And I'm not sure that I've even talked to this merchant. What do you sell? Anything good? One of my regulars had an unexpected guest drop in. Weird fellow. Couldn't quite place him. Anyway, you here to buy something, kid? Maybe. It depends what you got. Onion bombs, no. What if I sell some of this stuff to him? Like, can I unlock any items in the bazaar? A pebble. What would it take? Nothing. Maybe I've got to sell him something kind of strange. Something weird. And you guys can give me um, pointers on things to sell to these merchants if there's anything worth unlocking in the bazaar. But the only ones I've actually got to the merchant. Don't like jump ahead six cities gonna do me any good because I'll forget your comment. And I'll probably just halfway ignore it. Is this where I need to go? No, it's not. Yeah, it is. Ravanastrin. Can I go through these boxes? I'm supposed to deliver something to a man named of Ozilus. This is the place, right? And who was it that told you that? Old Delon. He said I have to give this to him personally. Does nothing get past that Delon? He has ears in every wall. All right, get inside. But not a word of what you see or hear in there. You got that? Yeah, sure. I know the Sky Pirate Code. 
Vaughn's been studying it since he was just like, Then what do you make of Andor's proclamation? Are you suggesting they fooled even the Marquis? What if a judge killed the king, not the captain? That would explain everything, wouldn't it? In that case, the captain would be brother to a judge. How are we to trust such a man? Well, they did torture him for, you know, ages. Now there is the Bosch that I remember. Then will you fight again at my side? His word alone what, he just had to trim his nothing. hair? I'd take his word over that of a mouthpiece Marquis. Then you name Rex liar with him. My brother was no liar! <sighs> just the opposite. Rex was the witness they needed. They had to make it appear as if I killed the king. Rex bears no blame. The fates have willed it. So this is Rex's brother. <sighs> Your words may convince a child such as this, but they weigh far too lightly on the scales for my taste. Our paths will remain separate. Do you not think Amalia worth saving? Ah, madame. I hold men's lives in my hands. I must see foes in every shadow. The night we moved against Vane, he knew. I will not chance such disadvantage again. I must treat you as I would Ondor, as I would treat any of better of the Empire. Then what will you do? Hold me here in chains? I'll kill you. That was far too... Some things never change, do they? Listen to Epic me, Bosh. Stare down. Your cage may have no bars, but it is a cage. The eyes of the Resistance watch unblinking. Let them watch. I know something of cages. Yeah, Lon, you just squeeze out of there, too. It's not the guy who the sword is meant for, though, is it? Bosh, give it back. We need to go find this Az guy. That's right. Amalia's in the Resistance. Then you know her. Sorta. We met just before we got sent to Nalbana. I've known nicer people. Our paths keep crossing yours and mine. It's more than coincidence. It's annoying. I'm sorry. Allow me one last annoyance, a favor to ask. I want you to take me to both here. Even caged birds need wings. This makes us even. Even? For Nalbana. We couldn't have done it without you. Then I guess we're already even. Right? I mean, now he's just gonna owe us another favor. Okay, so where the hell am I supposed to go now? Now, if I were a tired, thirsty sky pirate, where would I be? Well, that's pretty straightforward. Um, Bosh. I don't wanna go to this menu. Let's see. Your gambits pretty much. Oh, get a buckler on him. Got 309 LP, that is just. That's too much. What are, what are we even gonna make him? A knight would be basically, yeah, what he's meant for. Can you equip sword, shields, and heavy armors? Can you use Soul Eater to inflict damage? A breaker, warrior that uses all of nature as his weapons. Takes enemies down with one swing. Can use axes, hammers, and break. So it's basically going to be breaker or knight. I'm not even going to bother to look at the board. We do need a strong warrior, and I don't know how often Bosch will actually be in our group. Yes. So you are now a knight. With tons of LP to spend. Let's see. If he's gonna be a tank, he needs Firefly so he can re-attack, or even Battle Harness. For now, we'll just give him Firefly. Um, let's see. Tons of extra hit points. Last Stand increases defense. It's 70 MP, though. Quasimodo Boots. Okay, what abilities do you have? Tons of Gambit slots. Easily accessible. Consume hit points, damage foe, increases chance to block with a shield. An 
actually wouldn't be a bad one to go for. We'll have Valon and Fran be our damage dealers. Balthier be our white mage. <clears throat> and Bosch be our tank. Not exactly the path I wanted to take, but whatever. Where is his first LB? Fulminating Darkness. I think it's this one right here. Yeah, Fulminating Darkness. Maybe that just powers it up. Mm. 230 extra hit points. That's pretty significant. Gain MP. Hit points. First aid. Restore hit point to one hit point critical ally. That'd be a good backup gambit to have. Somebody dips critical, he can just drop that on him and then get back, get back to murdering. Um, let's see, heavy armor. We'll take these two, and then that'll open up two cheap gambit slots if needed. One could take extra hit points, get a gambit slot. That'd be two gambit slots. Work on just a little bit of hit points for him. I don't know why. It's probably not very ideal. Last stand. I wouldn't mind having last stand. Fully consumes user's MP, charging one ally's hit points to ten times that amount. This is tough. I don't need any of this extra high level armor. I'll unlock heavy armor too, because it's low level. I'm gonna bother with swords one. Um, hmm, okay. First aid, and we'll do last stand. And that's good enough for me. As for Vaughn, we're still saving up LP for you. You've got so much to go. Okay. So hang on. I forgot, you can now equip... No, I don't want... Oh, fuck, I didn't want Firefly. I wanted Battle Harness. Yep, sorry, Bosh. You got some basically worthless uh, stuff there, but whatever. You attack the party leader's target. We'll move this up here, and this will be when um, any allies hit points are critical. I don't have it unlocked yet, unfortunately. Where is it? No, I do have first aid unlocked. Ah, oh, you fucker. Okay, that's that's not how you enable it. Don't press don't press that button. Attack party leader's target. Um, what else do we have? I don't think you know any magic, and you're probably never going to. You can be the antidote guy. So there we go. First thing he'll do if they go critical is first aid them. If they're poisoned, he'll antidote them. I would say always, always do first aid over poison because if they're critical, the next auto attack or whatever could probably kill them. And then you attack there. It's for Vaughn. gonna kinda kind of mess things up, but any foe with lower hit points than 30. I want him to try to steal from. I'm going 30. I'd actually like to go lower. Wait. This is what I need. I'd actually like to go lower than that, like 20%, just because I don't want him to sit there and continue trying to chain steel clear that one 
but this is gonna this is just gonna be a test. If your hit points equal critical. Hmm. I've gotta be careful with this, because if I have multiple people set up to say auto revive, that might mess things up. But steal and attack, okay. For now, that, that setup will work for me. Now, where is the way out? Not that way. Yeah, we could go to the waterway, or... Isn't there another way? Am I wrong? I really don't want to go to the waterway yet. Where's the way out of this place? All the way over there. Uh, I'm probably gonna s I'm gonna save it and end the video and whenever we come back we'll probably go down to the waterway just to test that out test that hunt out and see if I can God damn it. see if we can actually complete one I'm not going to abandon any in fact I don't think you can I'm pretty sure you have to complete them in order and to get to get the next ones in the list which kind of makes me sad. But whatever. So, where is the nearest save point? I think it's probably all the way down at a damn gate. Yeah. If these teleport moogles charge to feed, they'd be rich by now. Or at least by the end of the game. So, I'm just going to end the video here. You don't have to see the save screen. Whenever we come back down into the waterway, most likely. Or apparently we're going to have a cutscene first. Never mind. Fine game, I won't put you down just yet. A lot of kids lost their parents in the war. Yeah, that's what wars do. Mine, mine had already died before that. The plague took them both. I'm sorry. I didn't know. As if it matters, though. Come it's okay. On. It's been five years now. After that, I lived with my friend Pinello and her family. Then, then the war came. I am sorry. You don't have to keep apologizing. Yeah, boss, really, it's damn. all right. I know it wasn't your fault. I or see that was now. It? You didn't kill my brother. Or did I? It was the Empire. My brother trusted you. And he was right. Not bad. Where you at, Moogle? I wonder if that's just a bonus little cutscene, or if you can actually bypass that completely. That doesn't matter where we teleport. It's nice to see Vaughn show a little maturity there. One thing about Vaughn, he's not—he's not whiny for the most part, and I actually appreciate them doing that for the first time in ages. So, whenever we come back, Gramsythe Waterway, ghost hunting.